The number of local high school basketball teams remaining in the boys and girls tournaments is dwindling. Today, two boys teams look to punch their tickets to state and a girls team look to win the whole thing. D1 regional final, Whitmer taking on Michigan State commit Kenny Kaminsky in Medina. Panthers with all the hustle plays here in the third. Nigel Hayes going coast to coast, making some nice moves. High off glass, hoop and the harm. Whitmer goes up four. And then it's Chris Wormley getting it in the post. He gets a bucket and the foul. He had nine. Panthers still up. Off a loose ball, it's Hayes running the court. Open court, one-handed jam. He had a game-high 17. Let's go to the fourth quarter. Another loose ball, this time ahead to Leroy Alexander. He does one better. He two-hands it. Whitmer goes up 12, and how about one more throwdown? Working it to Alexander again, this time, and one. He had 11, and Whitmer is headed to state 51-39. Coach Bruce Smith, tell us why. First of all, you got to have athletes, which we do. Second of all, you got to have intelligent kids that are willing to listen and do what you ask them. We have that, and the results are obvious. If you can get a steal and get a dunk like the one I had and Leroy had, that really gets the crowd into the game and the team going. And those are the type of plays that kills the other opponent's will to play. And uh, with those plays, we did that, and then we continue to play hard and aggressive, and that's why we came out the win. D2, Perkins and Elida at UT. Young Pirates Jacob, Caden, Michael, and Colin showing us the dance moves. Pirates junior Brandon Smith showing us some good footwork. Driving in, getting two. He had 24, but Perkins trailed by seven after three. Elida builds a double-digit lead thanks to Reggie. Don't call him Rachel McAdams. Three of his 25. Oh, under a minute left, Perkins fighting back, kicking it out. Nick Williams, pump fake, three-pointer. That is good. He had 17. They trail by four with less than a minute to go. Now down six. Williams again. They need this, and it's off back iron. Elida gets the board. Perkins eventually has to foul, and their season is over, 63-53. It's been a great ride. You know, these kids have uh, taken this program to places it's never been. Uh, you know, they've established a, a winning attitude. You know, unfortunately, you know, we want we want to go at least one more step, and uh, we got beat by a very good team. Arlington girls versus Berlin Highland for the Division Four state title. Let's go to the second quarter. Amelia Recker taking it in. Short jumper is good. She had ten. Red Devils up thirteen. End of the half. Danny Heaster, rebound, shot, and foul. She had 13. Arlington up 16 at the break. Another record in the third. Olivia off glass. That is good. Two of her 11. And finally on the break, Joy Reemsnyder ends up with it and gets the deuce. She had 11. And Arlington wins their first state championship, 52-37. to 37. One of my good friends wrote, wrote the girls a letter. He had experience winning state from Liberty Benton. And you know, he said, you won't believe the feeling when you win your last game. And uh, he, he's right. This feeling's unbelievable. Um, it, it, I don't know when it'll sink in. I'm on, the, I'm on cloud nine right now. I'm not sure. I, I want to come down. I mean, it's kind of unbelievable right now. I can't even explain how exciting it is. Uh, you know, just all, a whole bunch of emotions, all good ones, of course. And so I really can't even put into words of how I feel, but it's pretty awesome. The streets of Sylvania were shut down to honor the Northview hockey team with a parade this afternoon. Last weekend, the Wildcats won their first state championship, knocking off Lakewood St. Edward 5-2 in Columbus. That victory still sinking in for head coach Mike Jones. We're going to soak it up as long as we can and uh, just enjoy this moment. It's a great moment for the community and for these kids. We've been waiting a long time for this thing, so this is uh, what it's all about.